What is going on guys, Grave here today. I'd like to talk about the update we received for the Elder Scrolls Online today on console. This is update 2.28 for PS4, 1.10 for PS5, 1.26.4.0 for Xbox. I will have these patch notes for both platforms linked down in the description if you'd like to read over them for yourself. When it comes to the Rock Grove trial, the Wheel of Stone and Soul uh, achievements will now always be awarded when the criteria are met upon trial completion. That was an issue people have been talking about for a while now. They also did some things with uh, Bodestron Hollow. You once again, will, uh, the enemies will jump aggressively uh, closer to your character should you move away from the current location of some of the bosses. Uh, the Halls of Fabrication, they fixed an issue which caused the Assembly General to not drop weapons when killed on veteran difficulty. Uh, they fixed an issue where Crimson Oath and Silver Rose style pages were not dropping as intended. Uh, also, the Fighter's Guild Trap Beast, they fixed an issue where the ability could generate ultimate in some odd cases. Uh, they fixed an issue where ice fixtures could flicker when multiple crystal furnishings were placed in a home. And they fixed an issue where the Witch Tamed Bear Dog would be invisible when set as your active pet. Also, they fixed an issue uh, on Malabal Tor Fame would sometimes not drop loot correctly. They fixed a widespread issue that could cause certain light emitting furnishings to stop emitting light unexpectedly so they just quit working all together that has been a, a problem for a really long time i had that issue on ps4 over a year ago and i still had that issue on ps5 with some of the furnishings uh, in my home that are emitting light they will just quit working and you cannot get them to come back on unless the only way i could ever get it to work was actually you know remove them and then put them back you know where they were and it would actually work then they also fixed an issue with house guest version uh, where a uh, certain dialogue on a rocks would be limited to just a few lines if you'd already completed the Deadland story. They also fixed a, ver uh, a varying crash that could occur when you jumped from away from a zone at the same moment another player started consuming food. They fixed a crash that could occur when a large number of affected uh, particles are present on screen. And last but not least, they fixed an issue where a strangely uh, possessed vase in Stormhaven was uh, usable but did nothing upon activation it has since been fully banished from the material realm and is no longer usable of course that was in Stormhaven that is it for today's patch notes for the console version of ESO like I said the patch notes for PS4 PS5 and Xbox will be linked down in the description if you'd like to read over them for yourself of course leave me a comment with your thoughts if you like the video hit the like if you have not subscribed yet please do so be sure to check out everything down in the description the community discord my twitter and of course the affiliates here on the channel empire jerky and amazon associates also check out the merch store that is linked in the description as well and i'll catch you all next time peace